Hello everyone and welcome to our new Polopix DIY video. My name is Maggie and today I will be showing you how to do this dessert chore board. With this board you can easily plan your guilty pleasure of the week and you can easily add new recipes to your cake collection. This idea is also suitable for meal chores of your household or to-do lists for your children. In my case I made mine with some Polopix of the best cakes and sweets I could find and I put it in my kitchen. So here is what you're going to need. A bunch of Polapix with your favorite cakes and sweets recipes. I got mine from the Instagram blogger Diana Gajalova, who is my vegan dessert inspiration. A big wooden frame. Some thread and a couple of laundry pins. A pair of scissors, paper patch glue and some tape. Some decoration paper and embellishments of your choice. Make sure that you first order your Polopix with the Polopix app. You can find it in your app store or you can just click on the link in the description of this video. In the app you can choose photos from your phone library, from your Instagram account or you can just make an instant photo. You can manually add the names of the different desserts on the photos or you can write them with a marker afterwards. It will take a couple of days until the Polopix reach your home. Make sure you watch this video till the end to get some free Polopix. While you are waiting for your Polopix to arrive, you can start with the preparations. First, I apply one cover of Mod Podge on the outer and inner side of the box and I place the napkins on it. I add one more layer of Mod Podge on it and I let it to dry for a couple of hours. When I got both sides ready, it's time to attach the thread. You want to place the thread and the tape in this way so that they have enough space for two rows of hanging Polopix. Make sure that you cut the thread in the right place so that it stays tight. Finally, I add the laundry pins on both rows. When you get your delivery, it is time for the next step. Get one of them and put them on the first row. This will be the dessert of the first week. All the other Polopix you can spread on the second row. Optional, you can attach the recipe of every cake and the shopping list for it to the back of the side of the Polopix. If you like this idea, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to post your desserts scoreboard with your Polopix on Instagram with hashtag Polopix and hashtag Clixie. If you have never ordered Polopix, make sure you do this with this code here so you can get two free Polopix of your choice. Also, don't forget to check the author of this beautiful Polopix and the desserts on it, Diana Kajawa. You will find her links down below in the description. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you again in our next DIY Polopix video. Bye!